and we are live welcome to another episode ab traffic quick talk and today we're going to be talking about william cepeda versus giovanni cabrera the fight prediction and let's get right into the stats starting with william cepeda cepeda's 28 years old he is 5 foot 9 inches tall he has a 69 inch reach he has a record of 30 wins and zero defeats and now for Giovanni Cabrera. Cabrera is 29 years old. He is 5 foot 8 inches tall. He has a 70 inch reach. He has a record of 22 wins and 1 defeat. William Cepeda has proved over and over he belongs to share the ring with the elites. He's fought 8 times in the states. And they have thrown him some good opponents. And he hasn't slowed down. He's a machine. He's not afraid to throw. He's trying to get into your face and throw down. He doesn't throw 1. He doesn't throw 2. He throws 3, 4, 5, 6 punches at a time he's highly dangerous he will not stop coming for you giovanni cabrera is no chump he's looking to bring the fight to you he's not afraid to exchange he has a lot of heart his chin is made out of stone the man could fight cabrera against pitbull cruz he had trouble he couldn't get cruz off of him cepeda is going to smother him and overwhelm cabrera it's going to be a fun fight back and forth but eventually i see cepeda breaking him down cepeda is a huge betting favorite cepeda is young Young, undefeated, has a lot of hype around him. Cepeda has 30 fights with 26 knockouts. Cepeda has power. He's constantly frustrating his opponents. He gives them zero space to operate. He has a really good style. Cabrera works best when he keeps the fight in mid-range. He has great accuracy. He knows how to select his shots. He just needs to keep Cepeda off of him. I could see Cabrera catching the upset here. He's a great boxer. He has heart. He's trying to win. He's flashy he's strong he's fast but against his style he struggles he has the experience of fighting pitbull who fights exactly the same as cepeda pitbull seems to possess some good good power the way he had cabrera reacting to every punch was wild his head kept getting rocked there's some people who will argue that cabrera did enough but i don't know man i saw pitbull do what he was supposed to do i think it's about time william cepeda steps into the ring with some big names he was supposed to fight Shakur Stevenson but that fight didn't happen. I like Cepeda's chances here. Both guys are all offense. They lack a lot of defense. Both of them gets hit a lot. They don't care to get hit. For my prediction I'm leaning towards Cepeda. I think the experience and just his style overall would be too much. But don't get me wrong. Cabrera didn't look horrible against Pitbull. It was a very close fight. He fought back in March against Ricardo Quiros and he beat him decisively by unanimous decision. I know he's going to make this fight competitive and very difficult for Cepeda. But I see Cepeda outworking Cabrera and just beating him in a close fight. We really don't know how good William Cepeda is. He hasn't gone against a big elite fighter but let's see let's see what happens cabrera is going to bring that pressure he's going to bring the fight he's going to bring that offense can cepeda fight on the back foot because cabrera can he's not great at it but i'm sure he's been working on it so regardless of who wins this fight i think it's going to be a very close fight a very hard competitive fight and let the best man win it's a great fight between a mexican born fighter and a mexican american fighter it's very exciting and i'm looking for a for it. And that's all I got for you guys. Don't forget to drop a like, a subscribe, a comment, a share. Do all that good stuff for me. Until next time.